Yes, it's election day. So, I'm cycling, because you know what? It's become almost impossible to actually drive around London. Not just the 20 miles an hour, but the low traffic neighborhoods, the surveillance cameras, the fines, the ticketing, the bollards, all coming in under emergency traffic orders during lockdowns, that's right. Remember the lockdowns? No one wants to talk about them now. No one wants to talk about the lockdowns, the 45,000 people, that we lost as care workers because of the vaccine mandate, the hundreds of thousands of frontline care staff in the NHS who were threatened with it, and all of us that challenged it. Very few people want to talk about that now. Ask your candidates where they stood on that, where they stand on it now, where they stand on the Public Health Act and lockdowns in the future, what they think about the WHO and the international health regulations and sovereignty in the UK. Ask them what they think about the impact of children and closing our schools and why Sweden had a different method and why were people smeared and censored and suffocated and why do we have spy units sent after us? Ask them all these questions because we want to say never again and that's why we're organised and together. So in this election, make your voice heard. You know who I'm voting for, but you guys, let's everyone make sure we go out there Let's have spoke to our candidates. Let's vote today. Let's make a difference. And then tomorrow, we're going to carry on campaigning, organising, lobbying, rallying, engaging, calls to actions. Make sure that we are having our voices heard, that the public is at the centre of things. Whether it's our institutions and the fact that you've got debanking because people don't like what people say, and free speech and all of the other issues. And let's do that together.